Hi! I am super excited. This Sunday is going to be one of the best days of my life. I am going to go to Universal Studios to go to Harry Potter World. Oh, I'm so excited I could shake the camera, but I won't because it's an expensive piece of equipment and I can't be that reckless. Wearing my Gryffindor shirt because, you know, house pride, right? Fun and convenient fact, my high school colors were the color of the Gryffindor house. Cue the Letterman's jacket. Yes. Ugh, I haven't worn this in such a long time, it feels so weird. I have been looking forward to this day for six years. I know they opened up Harry Potter World in about 2010 or 11, and as soon as they opened it up, I was like making all these outrageous plans to go because I, I love Harry Potter, like what can I say? Um, not really realizing that I was in high school and I didn't have a job and my parents were not going to pay for me to go to Harry Potter World in Orlando because nobody else, okay, first of all, I didn't have anybody else that I could have gone with me at all because nobody that I knew worked. The last time I went to Universal was in 2011 for a theater trip and which is funny, the same theater trip that I went when I went to the Warner Brothers studio and I saw the Harry Potter props and I was freaking myself out. I said that I was going to do a video on my experience there. I still probably will. I'm going to definitely vlog the trip and I'm going to do like a haul and like a Harry Potter experience video. Like, it's going to go all out. Anyways, I am super excited for Harry Potter World and just Universal Studios in general because that's actually one of my favorite theme parks. There isn't as many rides as Disneyland. Like, Disneyland is my top favorite theme park, but Universal is like a close second. The other things that they have there are just so interesting. Like, I love the back lot and looking at things, and I, they're horror, Halloween haunted horror nights. So, in honor of going to Universal for Harry Potter World, I thought I would pull up my computer, and I'm just gonna look up Harry Potter World and look up the things to do. I already know that there's certain things that I want to do, but I'm going to like look up all the features and we're going to go over them and I'm just going to fangirl and you're going to watch me fangirl and we're going to fangirl together. All right? I'm already planning on spending like my whole paycheck on Harry Potter merch. I thought about getting a house robe, but then my friends were just like, nah, and I looked at the price and they're $150, and I'm like, we'll see. I don't know yet. Upgrade to VIP. Be pampered like a star. I'm okay with that. I am a star. Oh, shoot. Oh, it's $359 a person. I'll just go to Warner Brothers. Literally, it costs the same amount to go to Warner Brothers. And I, I love Warner Brothers. Like, there was a time period where I, like, was constantly searching for jobs. But the only thing is, like, I don't have a degree in anything relevant. And, well... I'm working on a degree. But. And I live too far to work at Warner Brothers. Like, that's literally a two, two and a half, three hour commute with traffic. Without traffic, it's not that bad, but with traffic, oh. Okay, what I don't understand is you know how they have their season pass at Universal Studios and it's $139? Well, don't they have a thing where it's by day and get the rest of the year free? I'm so confused about how that works. Anyways, attractions overview The Wizarding World of Harry. Potter. I'm obviously really excited for like Harry Potter and the Forbidden Journey which is like when you go through Hogwarts if I'm correct like that's all I've ever dreamed of is going through Hogwarts it's a really pretty thing. Make your way through the classrooms and corridors of Hogwarts then soar above the castle grounds on a groundbreaking new ride that lets you join Harry Potter and his friends on an unforgettably thrilling adventure. It sounds like a plan and Harry Potter and the Flight of the Hippogriff. This looks so awesome. Like, I've already seen stuff from it, like people's Snapchats and videos, and it's really awesome. Like, I've seen the Hufflepuff, or the choir, I think that's really cool, with the frog. That's so cute! I really cannot wait to go to the three broomsticks. And I cannot wait to get butterbeer. I'm going to be butterbeering it up. 
And you know what? One other thing I really am excited for is going to Ollivander's and testing out my own wand and like maybe buying one because I know one of my friends who went to Universal Orlando when she went to Harry Potter World they actually had like custom wands that weren't characters wands but you could just buy them so that's awesome like is my camera really about to die it was like at full battery like 20 minutes ago I'm gonna make this really quick and like she had the whole experience of choosing a wand and having it go awry and I guess all that stuff I don't know if it was real or whatnot, but it sounded awesome, and that's one thing I'm really excited for. I also want to try some of the candy. I would love to try the chocolate frogs, and I would love to try the Berry Bots Every Flavored Beans, which I know they've been around, but I just never, I never got them. I'm excited to go to the Zonko's Joke Shop. I guess other than that, the thing I'm most excited for is just going there and feeling the atmosphere of what it would be like to go to Hogwarts and live in that community of wizards. I just, you know what I mean? Like, I want to walk around and get a lot of good pictures and have a great time with my best friend before she leaves to Tennessee because she's moving to Tennessee with her family and because her family's from there and this is going to be like one of the last times we ever get to hang out so we both love Harry Potter. This is going to be like the adventure to end all adventures for us so that's all I can say. My camera's about to die and it was really nice talking to you guys. Anything that you think I should know or you want me to know, leave a comment down below. It doesn't matter if you're in Orlando or California. We're just going to talk about this and have like a Harry Potter fangirling fest. It would be really nice if you were to subscribe to my channel and you could see all my other Harry Potter videos and all my Disney videos that are to come and just all my hauls and all my lovely things that are coming. A play on the username. <laughs> Anyways, I'm just, I, I need to go, but it was wonderful talking to you guys, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!